Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the nearby nation, I'm going to show you today how to get Takit 1.1.4 beta for Minecraft 1.0. And the reason why is the old server, Beast Node, is still got another week and a half left. Uh, so I figured I'd put uh, Takit on there for just a little bit so we could test it out, see what the bugs are and all that before we actually decide whether or not to move it to the main server. So here's how this is going to be set up. Basically, we want to do a little back saving. We want to back up our dot Minecraft. So what we want to do is go to my computer or computer, your local disk, go to users, your name, and then right here it says it's kind of like grayed out a little bit or transparency a little bit app data. The reason for that is it's a hidden file or folder. Now how you do that is you just go organize, folders and search options, show hidden files and folders. It'll be clicked right here. You just want to click it right there and it'll show app data. So then you go into app data, go into roaming, and here's your dot Minecraft. Now what I do is I just save a Minecraft backup folder on my desktop and uh, basically just move it over. And usually I would move it back and forth, back and forth, but the next video that will be up will show you exactly how to do this using a profile manager instead of switching back and forth yourself which could make some mistakes because it always has to be named dot minecraft so you unless you have it in like a folder that says takit or tech it whatever you want to call it so you know that's your your dot minecraft for takit then uh you're going to be lost on all the dot minecrafts so plus you can't put more than one dot minecraft so you have to have multiple folders and it just gets really annoying so I'll show you a profile manager uh, here pretty soon. Uh, let's go to Minecraft.exe and we gotta run this. Type my name in. Remember, it'll load up. Downloading Minecraft. Just gotta wait. This is downloading 1.1. Now we need 1.0 in order to run this. So how are we gonna do this? Well, right here, they give you the answer. Right here. Use MC Nostalgia to downgrade your Minecraft if needed. You can get it here. So click right there. And it'll be right here. Now, I already have it in my... F actually, no, I don't actually have it. Click right there. <laughs> it's an AdFly link. This will take a little bit to download, so... Might as well get it started now. Skip that. Download. Alright, so we're going to let that download for a second. Close that out. Go back into Technic Pack. I'll have links in the description for this. So uh, right here is the direct client. This is what we're going to need as well. So click right there. It's right here. It's a really small one, so it'll open up quickly. Now what I do is just throw this on my desktop. This will be the second step, so we're going to need that as well on your desktop. So now we're just waiting on MC Nostalgia to download, which is going to take a little bit, but oh well. We have time to wait. Sitting here on a screen. Not really. I'll be back when uh, it downloads. Okay, so it's just about downloaded, and uh, what I do want to tell you guys is this is a 7-zip right here, and this is a zip folder. If you want to unzip these, if you want to open them, you're going to have to get WinRAR. You can get WinRAR by going to Google. WinRAR click that it'll link you to a download page and you just basically select your language click it and download it that way you can open these up so MC nostalgia is now done gonna do that um, I'd rather just uh, move it to the desktop and then right click extract to so it'll extract to that folder and then we come in here this is a really quick step make sure your minecraft is closed go to MC nostalgia it'll say Press enter to see the list of downgraded possibilities. So if you press enter, you can get any type of Minecraft that you want. And this is the legal way, guys. This is the way to do it. So as you can see, 1.0 is number one. So what I want to do is go down to right here, press one, press enter, done. Press enter to exit. Now, if you come into Minecraft, like so, 1.0.2. We're back. We're back so we can actually install the Technic Pack. So right there is the installer. It's a jar file. If you don't have Java, which you should have Java. I don't know if you need the JDK or not, but you should have Java because you have to run Minecraft. So, But uh, set target for Minecraft folder. This is the exact same place that we went earlier. 
So you want to go into your name, app data, roaming, Minecraft, open. Now click next. Now you want a full install for this to work. So click next. And it's done. So now we actually have, if I open up, if I open up Minecraft, in multiplayer, add a server, That is the address. I'll go ahead and link it down below to takeet.nearbynation.com. Click done. As you can see, no one's in there yet. Click on it. And make it daytime. Ooh, loud world. Remember your sound and all is gonna be way up. I just wanna turn it off because I don't have my headphones on. But uh this is the Takeet, Tekkit, whatever world that we have set up for you guys for about a week and a half uh, just to test it out again so also um, right now as you can see you'll have all these items you can't click them and get them we don't want you to do that what we want you to do though is in case you do need to know how to make the item press R and you can click on the item that you need to make say you don't know how to make let's go up here to items I see two double click you don't know how to make a reactor that's how you make a reactor you don't know how to make advanced alloy Hmm. Might have to go to the blocks for that. Totally failing at trying to find advanced alloy. Really? Should not happen. Should be able to double... Oh, oh wait. There we go. Whoa. Maybe. Oh, that's items with coal. So basically, if I do uh, don't nuclear reactor, I don't want you to make that, but still. Uh, you should see advanced alloy somewhere in here on one of these pages if you right-click on it. Or not. Okay, so I'm totally lying. But uh, anyways, I wish it would show advanced alloy, but it doesn't. Might be under something else. Item sublist. IC2. Just shows the blocks doesn't actually show hmm anyways guys you guys get the gist um, basically you just come in here and if you need to find how to make something like you don't know how to make one of these you just click on it and press R and there you go that's how you make it you take four of those you don't know how to make that it shows you how to make that right there all the chunks and if you don't want this annoying thing up, say you just want to see the whole screen besides with this, go to options, disable. And there you go. You're in Minecraft. You have no extra GUI set up except for up there in the corner, which of course your period key is your menu. You can disable, enable, whatever you want for that. So there, that's basically it. Go ahead and get on there and start enjoying. If you don't know how to get the, the whitelist, I'm also making another video for the whitelist. So check that one out too. There'll be like three videos up. See you guys in the server. This is going to be awesome to test out. Bye, guys.